Hilton Head Island, South Carolina, final round of the RBC Heritage. A man with experience getting around Harbortown, Matt Kuchar, holding out at the third, two birdies in his first three holes, and he was off and running, looking for a chance at another win at the RBC Heritage. C.T. Pan, though, he had designs of a maiden victory. The approach shot at the ninth, 116 yards, missed to four feet, and Pan would pick up his second birdie on the front side. Shane Lowry, 36-hole leader, right back in the thick of things, working with the lead as he takes it to 12 under par. Lowry looking for win number two of his PGA Tour career. Back to Pan. Downhill putt at the 10th, so after the birdie at nine, he would add another to start the inward half and he would get to 11 under. Now at 12, solo lead, he's got it. As he pours it in and Pan on his way. 12 under his score, Patrick Cantlay looking to get to double digits, downhill putt, beautiful 14th hole, and he makes that to get to 10 under par. So Cantlay contending and Matt Kuchar looking for birdie at 15, and that gets him to 11 under, and Kuchar making a charge with those fans in tow. Lowry now at 14. He dropped back to nine under, but makes the birdie, and Lowry trying to hang in there. Patrick Cantlay at 15, missed the par five. Second shot to the right of the green, then plays it across the putting surface, and this would lead to a share of the lead with a tap in birdie. So Cantley joining C.T. Pan, and now Matt Kuchar, first to get to the clubhouse with an 11 underscore as he buries the birdie and the fans go crazy at 18. So he would wait to see how things would play out. 16th hole after a poor par five 15th, C.T. Pan dropped a shot at 15. He comes back with the birdie at 16, takes the solo lead and looking to finish with one more. Oh, so close. He would have a tap in par, but that would be enough as he would hold off the rest of the Chargers. And for the first time in his young PGA Tour career, he finds out that he's the winner. And at 12 under winning by a shot over Matt Kuchar, we move from the RBC Heritage to the Zurich Classic of New Orleans as we look forward to Thursday's coverage beginning at 8 a.m. Eastern on NBC Sports Gold.